What's up? Hi guys! It's been so long since I did a YouTube video where I'm like talking to the camera. But yeah, today I'm gonna be working on my desk setup. I don't know, I keep changing my desk setup mainly because it keeps me creative when I organize or fix something or clean it up. I hope it inspires me to write more new songs. <laughs> I've changed my desk setup this year like three or four times already, but this time I'm gonna be vlogging it. <laughs> I'm gonna be showing you guys what I'm gonna be doing to my desk setup. As you can see, compared to my previous desk setup, it now has a monitor. Before, when I did my very first desk setup or equipment tour, some sort of video, way, way back, I didn't have a monitor yet and my desk was on the other side of the room. So now it's in the middle of my room. But yeah, I'm filming this before I change it up so you guys can see how it looks like. And I'm gonna be vlogging the process of me picking up some stuff. Most of the stuff I'm gonna be buying are gonna be from online shops. Mainly because I can't go out, it's COVID. I mean, I can go out, but like, I'd rather not. And I'm really excited because I think I might be modifying this desk to raise my speakers a little bit. So I'm probably gonna finally drill it. And I'm also gonna work on the cable management because right now the cable management of my desk is okay. It's not the best, but it looks clean from afar. But if you look into it, it's actually really messy. So I might end up fixing it and yeah, just redoing everything, the entire desk. And as of the moment, the monitor is on a stand and I think to clean up the space, I'm gonna be mounting it on a monitor mount so it's floating and I get to use the extra space at the bottom. So this is basically the setup 2020 but then 2021 let's just pretend like <laughs> we're revamping this desk for 2021 if i choose to revamp it again i'm probably gonna just post it on my instagram <laughs> so yeah i'm gonna be doing a bunch of modifications to this table i'm gonna be fixing everything organizing everything so i'm really excited and i can't wait for you guys to see the final output My monitor mount came in today and I'm really excited. I'm going to be spray painting this white so it matches my desk. It's 1,200 pesos from Shopee. I saw a lot of good reviews about this mount so I decided to get it. It's the NB North Bayou, Bayou mount. I'm finally going to mount my monitor. <laughs> of course, I had to sanitize this first before bringing it into my room and opening it. Safety first. There we go. Sorry if I look like this, by the way, I just woke up and I'm not a morning person. Here we go. So it, oh, oh gosh, that's so heavy. It holds 17 to 27 inches monitors. So my monitor is, I think, 27 inches, I think. I forgot, but yeah, it's not more than 27 if it's not 27. So we have the screws and the mount itself. It's heavy. It seems like it's durable. Let's see how we'll set this up. This morning, this came in. I bought it from Shopee for 188 pesos. Shockingly, it's so cheap. Um, I haven't opened it, but basically it's a microphone stand that clamps onto my desk. So I don't have this thing here because the tendency with my mic stand here is when, I, when someone's over there, they get to bump this and sometimes the mic is just not safe. So I'm gonna be mounting the microphone stand onto my desk. It's black. So I'm gonna spray paint it white to match the aesthetic of my desk and including the monitor stand. I'm gonna be spray painting a lot of stuff white just so they blend in with my desk setup. Not bad for 188 pesos. Ah. Not bad, it doesn't look cheap it doesn't look that cheap it was on sale that's why it used to be like 600 bucks let's see how it looks like on my desk <laughs> okay ah almost dropped it <laughs> okay so this is like the clamp thingy i honestly have no idea how to install this yet but it seems easy it's just like two parts so oh gosh this one goes onto the table I have to unscrew this and then which one is the this one Oh, there we go. There we go. Okay, so let's try and install it now. Let me move this first. Hmm. It's actually quite short. Did I do this right? I think I did. Oops. 
See what I mean about this mic stand? Okay, let's transfer the mic onto the boom arm. <gasps> it looks good! I love it! Let me try this with the cable. Let's see. Damn, there we go. I love it! Oh my gosh. Why didn't I think of this before? I've been struggling with that mic stand on the side of my desk for so long and I should have just gotten this. Oh my god. Ugh. Look at that, it looks so clean. Wow, I should have just done this way back. Okay, so we're gonna be spray painting now the mounts and my mic stand so we're gonna be going outside today we're gonna be spray painting here in this area I have the spray paint here ready and these are the stuff we're gonna be spray painting today we are done we're gonna bring these up to my room now Okay, so for our agenda today, the reason why we're going outside is because we're looking for some pipes to hold the speakers, like elevate them, kind of like that. We are on our way to Home Depot to look for these pipe thingies. So we're looking for something like that and something like this. Okay, so we went to Home Depot here, but apparently they don't have it. <sighs> I don't know where we're gonna go next, but we're gonna look for the piping for the speakers and hopefully they have it in a different Home Depot. So yeah, going back in the car. Okay, we're at our second Home Depot for today. Hopefully they have it already. They have it. They have it. They have it. Okay, so we found the steel pipe things. Now we're looking for a kuya to help us out for the rest. Ate, uh, dalawang hot dog. Yung isa with bread, yung isa wala. Dalawa lang po. Okay, so we went to the hardware, right? And we weren't able to find the ring, this ring thing that we screw onto this pipe that we bought. So I remembered I had spare rings like this for my old shelves. So I just got a pipe that actually fit the, the ring thing. I don't know what it's called. But yeah, and it surprisingly it fits and we just spray painted it white to match the entire desk. And as you saw earlier, Instead of using an actual shelf, we bought chopping boards and it does the job. We're gonna be installing these tonight because I have to get my desk fixed because I have a guesting tomorrow afternoon and yeah, I just want everything to be fixed before I go on camera and so I have and so that I have nothing to worry about. Ming Ming's barking. Okay, so we finally have everything set. I have the mount, the speaker stands, and we're ready to drill my table. But right now, I just have to empty it up first before I actually start so that nothing gets in the way while we're fixing the desk. Okay, 
If you guys are gonna mount anything onto your table, blue tack is the way to go because it doesn't make a mess on your desk. So yeah, if you guys wanna make something secure on your table and don't want it falling off, use blue tack. Speakers off. Got it. Turning off the speakers. Thank you. You got it. <laughs> I love it when she replies back. It doesn't make me feel that much lonely. Because when I say, hey Google, I miss you. Until we chat again. I love it. Can you play Sad Songs by Alicia? Sad Songs. Playing Lisa on Spotify. No, not Lisa! <laughs> so I'm gonna be removing everything off my desk. I'm not sure if I'll have to change the wiring under, but I think I will have to. So it's gonna be a long night. <laughs> This is how messy it is back here. And wait till we get under. Oh my god. So many cables. Okay, speakers are done. Oh, that's dusty. Studio off. Okay, turning off studio. Okay, so far we have the stands already drilled in and now we're going to be measuring the table so we know where to place them. This is the first one we did and the second one going here. My mom and I decided we're going to be doing the mount first of the monitor before we attach the speakers just so we're sure that it doesn't bump into each other. This is the current situation for the cable management and I'm gonna be plugging everything in first and then organize. So wish me luck. I've been working on the cable management and I think it's looking so much better than a while ago. Not bad. Everything is going through one dongle that connects to my laptop so it can power everything. And yeah, so much better than a while ago. A lot cleaner. It's not perfect because there still a lot of wire showing from the back but from the front it looks super clean which I'm really proud of. It's already fixed. No wires are showing. I'm really happy about that. And yeah, the speakers look so good. And the mount of the monitor is just looking so good. And I attached some LED lights behind the monitor too. So that's why it's glowing right now. But now for the moment of truth, we have to power everything on. Okay, let's try powering everything on. Studio on. Activating studio mode. Ah, there we go. Check it out. The wires are so clean. Dang. Look. Oh my gosh. Not much wire showing, just those two from the speakers, but I'll figure out a way to clean that up soon. But, whoa, it looks so good. Okay, it is the next morning and 
it's done so the desk is now complete i finished around 2 30 a.m this morning and wow i'm so happy with how the desk finally looks like i think i did a pretty good job on the cable management it's so much better than the last time the last time it was just cables everywhere but now check it out it's so clean i just have like two huge wires showing through which are for the monitors maybe just like a dongle wire going through for the computer but other than that it's so clean it doesn't look distracting in a sense so i'm very proud of myself for this project <laughs> it probably took me like collectively around six hours to complete super worth it guys i'm gonna be doing some desk montage in a bit i hope you guys enjoy it that is it for my desk setup thank you guys so much for watching i hope you guys enjoyed this video it's been so long since i did a video about my desk or my setup so i hope you guys enjoyed and stay tuned because i'm gonna be going in depth on my equipment on my desk or what equipment i use for music production make sure to subscribe to my channel hit that like button share this video comment down below your thoughts or any video suggestions if you guys want me to touch on certain topics about music production or about my setup please let me know in the comments and I'll see you guys in the next video. Stay lit fam! I support you! Hey!